guys today in this video you know about how big of a beam do i need to span 20 foot length you have to figure out the beam size required to span 20 foot length in this video you have to find out the beam size like the wood beam size required to spend 20 foot lbl that is laminated veneer lumber beam required to spend 20 foot and the last one that is steel beam also known as w beam required to spend 20 foot length here we make a rough diagram to understand about the american wide flange beam here we make a rough diagram to understand about the american wide flange beam this one is the horizontal section of beam known as flange and flange generally resist bending moment and this one is the vertical section of beam known as web and it resist generally shear forces and this one is the width of flange and th that is the thickness of flange and this one is the depth of the wide flange beam and the, you know that the beam size depending on several factor the first factor that is what will be the load that is total load about 50 pound per square foot consists of dead load and live load second the factor that is building code in your area and third factor that is what will be the span length and grade of material are used to make beam a structure and first you know about the wood beam size wood beam size required to span 20 foot length the dimensional lumber you should take to span for 20 foot length you can use three ply of 2 by 12 piece of dimensional lumber and it can also written as 6 inches by 12 inches dimensional lumber in which the nominal width of beam that is about 6 inches and the nominal depth of beam that is about 12 inches it means you can use 3 ply of 2 by 12 inch of dimensional lumber as wood beam required to spend 20 foot length now consider the laminated veneer lumber beam size required to spend 20 foot length now the lbl beam you can use the double ply that has width three and a half inches times the depth of beam that is nine and half inches deep in which the nominal width of lbl beam that is four inches and actual width that is three and a half inches and the nominal depth of this lbl beam is about 10 inches and their actual deep is about nine and a half inches that's why you can use double ply of 10 inch lbl to spend 20 foot distance and now the steel beam size steel beam size required to spend 20 foot length it is also known as w beam that is american wide flange beam and it can written as w10 multiply 20 it means you can use steel beam size w10 multiply 20 beam also known as i beam for 20 foot a span in which w is wide flange beam and the nominal depth of beam is about 10 inches and weight of beam that is about 22 pounds per foot it means w indicate wide flange beam and 10 indicate their nominal depth and the last figure 22 indicate their weight of beam in pounds per foot this is the three different type of beam size required to spend 20 foot length thank you